Hey guys, welcome back. So on part one on uh, the whole operating system deployment, I'll show you guys how to get your boot images up and running and also add the feature to troubleshoot so you can press F8. So the next thing that you want to do is create a package for uh, definition, from definition. So the reason we're doing this is because uh, when you're installing your operating system to a new machine, you want the SCCM client to be installed, so it can automatically start talking to SCCM and you know do all the all the packaging, the advertisements, and whatever you have on your console. So we're actually going to right-click on your packages. We're going to go to New, Package from Definition. We're going to go to Next, and what you want is Configuration Manager Client Upgrade. Hit Next and what the option that you want to do is you want to always obtain files from a source directory okay and the UFC pass would be actually your your SCCM server SM, SMS BNT which is BNT is my site name my site code and you want to go into the client sorry client copy that paste it there hit next and hit finish and close this out and as you can see we have our package so there we go so so far so good what I like to do is I would like I normally like to right click on it go inside of properties and just rename it you know give it uh, installation you know so you know what it is you know it's a client installation It's not really a client upgrade so the next thing that you want to do is you want to right click on your distribution point and you want to create a new distribution point hit next you're only gonna have we're actually gonna have two and if you or if you have been following with me with the past SCCM videos, the reason that you got this one is because we added the Pixie roll. But you only want to do it to your main one, not to your Pixie. Okay? So we're gonna hit next, and you're good to go. Then you want to right click, update the distribution point or the DP. Hit yes. And once you do that, you're you're basically good to go, guys. I mean. If you want to check the status of the package, just go to package status. Go in there. And it's still install pending. So it's still doing its magic. So I'm going to see if I could right click and refresh it to see if it. Uh, it's still install pending. But uh, most likely it takes some time and most it's going to say install, then you're good to go. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please Twitter it. Please Facebook it. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.